just across the river in East Nashville is where we find our Chris O'Brien. Chris and Hector have been out in the northern half of Davidson County and the east side with most, you know, for most of the day joining us with the latest. Chris, good evening. Yeah, it is uh, quite cold out here in East Nashville. We're at the corner of Eastland and uh, Chapel right here. Uh, and as the sun has gone down, the cold has come up quite a bit. And as we've continued to reiterate throughout the day, uh, TDOT is telling a lot of people, hey, do what you can to stay off the roads. But uh, as we found out and as you've probably found out today, uh, not everybody followed uh, that, that good piece of advice. Monday was, well, chilly. It's very cold. Roads are slick, but got to get the job done. It's freezing. <laughs> Cameron Barrett works for a company that helped plow around Middle Tennessee. When we caught up with them, they had been on the road for 23 hours straight. Where are y'all headed next? Um, actually, we're finishing here and then hopefully Murfreesboro. <laughs> but as the snow plows made their way around, it didn't stop everybody from staying off the roads. The big issue TDOT faced Monday was the snow just kept coming. It's almost like just treading water, but we're going to keep at it. You know, we are uh, getting some contract crews to come in with graders to help us push the snow off the shoulders. That way our trucks can stay focused on the on the interstate. In the Madison neighborhood, they're still picking up the pieces from a deadly tornado last month. But a fresh coat of snow brings new challenges. My hometown's Panama City, Florida. We had Hurricane Michael in 18. We just had several tornadoes come through there last week. I think the inclement weather is not indicative of just here. There's a lot of places having some inclement weather now. You know, welcome to cyclical weather changes. And of course, it wasn't just Madison feeling the effects. All over Davidson County, people from both inside Tennessee and outside were braving the conditions. Uh, we're from Michigan, and I've seen a... Uh, Pretty much a goat path going down the express where everybody's in single file line. With the roads being as slick and dangerous as they are, the Midwesterners offered one important piece of advice. I only go if you have to. In Davidson County, Chris O'Brien. <laughs> And so what can you do to uh, stay off the roads? Well, one way to do it, hey, find yourself a local bar. This is Rose Pepper uh, at the corner of uh, Chapel and Eastland, like I said. Uh, like I keep saying all day, have a beer, find, find, find yourself some good friends, find a warm spot, and uh, brave out this cold weather. Because let me tell you, uh, it is pretty cold. Bob Haley, I'll send it back to you.